Well, I always felt that no one really accepted me because of the way I looked or the way I spoke. They always, like, they actually treated me as a germ. I'm not tall enough and I'm not skinny enough and my hair is a different color than everybody else's. It's red and it's not something that you normally see in somebody. When I was in elementary school people used to just say call me what they call me so many names. The <laughs> one that I hear all the time is the the soul joke, how I have no soul. I would feel lost like there's nowhere to turn. I don't have anything that I can do about it. And I feel like if I went and told someone that they'd come at me even harder. She's all about herself. All lonely. You gay? You lesbian? Ooh. You ugly person? You're stuck. Stupid. You ugly. You're stupid. Where's your girlfriend at? She's not here to take me down. Yeah, you're skinny. Ooh. Toothpick. You. Ooh. 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 I didn't feel safe in school. I went home to my mom basically just crying, you know, these people are hurting me and I wish I could just make it stop. I wish they would stop, but they just didn't understand that, you know, words hurt. It, it sticks with you. After a while, you start to believe all the things that are said to you and you don't feel happy. You don't feel like going to school anymore just because of what people are saying to you. Words do have power. Bullying is trying to hurt someone, you know, making them feel like like they're not worth anything, like they're trash. Uh, I saw this girl you know, go up to this boy's face. She was taller than him. She she went up and shook him by the shoulders, telling him things. I saw it and I just felt so bad. I was so scared that I didn't say anything and I feel bad that I didn't. That was me. What if that was someone I cared about? I remember um, when I was in middle school, I was kind of shy with girls. And I remember there was definitely girls that showed interest in me. But because I was shy, I would always sort of never respond to their attention. And I remember being teased at, oh, you're gay, you're gay. Even my own friends would join in and laugh and not stand up for me because they were afraid of not looking cool or, you know, you know, they, they wanted to be part of the group. And, it, and I remember that being painful on, on many levels. And people need to, I, I think for people that are being bullied, um, who the hell are they, all right? Don't let people that you personally don't love or care about, don't let their opinions or anything they say matter because they, they're nothing to you. Bullying to me is picking on someone less fortunate than you, making them feel bad, I guess, because of what they are. Well, I got, I was bullied with, uh, basically from when I was little to, um, I guess, three years ago, I was fat. Puberty had not hit then, so everybody, I remember somebody telling me not to sit beside them because I was going to take up two people's places. Yeah, it hurt, but you know, puberty hit and you know, I just kind of got over it. Everyone just get treated the same, uh, no matter who you are, what you are, what you do, everybody just have the same mentality and just have a good positive vibe on other people and we can just prevent bullying. Tell somebody you're not a snitch and if you think it doesn't affect you, it really does. So talk to somebody about it and well, um, hold on strong, believe that it would stop and it's mostly mind over matter because it ends up stopping especially when you report. Now you would probably stand up for yourself. Don't let someone talk down on you because everyone is different but like you gotta learn how to accept other people. My advice would be that uh, to love yourself first because I, I feel like if you don't love yourself then no one else will. And so if, if someone's making fun of you, if you are you, if you're content in yourself and you know you're beautiful, you know you're not stupid, and you know you're not the things that they're telling you, I mean, it'll be easier to stand up for yourself and tell them what you feel about them and how you feel about yourself.